Hi. Today's, well, tomorrow's gonna be my birthday, but guess what it is? It's Legally Blonde Auditions. Yay! So, here's the thing. I've literally spent, like, I go on auditions a lot, but they're mostly self-tape auditions. But the most terrifying auditions are the ones at Lake Park for some reason. They're just so daunting to me and I have no idea why. Because I literally went on harder auditions than this, but just like the fact that like the cast just is coming out on like the same day as like doing the auditions, it's terrifying. I'm supposed to be watching Euphoria right now because it just came out, season two, a new episode. But like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna practice dance. I'm gonna practice the dance first. I don't know, maybe I'll print out the song and do that one too. Cause I'm still debating on which one to do, but I'm heavily leaning towards, oh my god. Cause why not? So, uh, yeah, let's do that. I don't have much time, but it's my birthday. Okay, bye. I'm doing birthday girl. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Birthday. It's Haley's birthday. It's my birthday. It's birthday. It's birthday. It's birthday. It's birthday. I cried a lot today. That's how I be feeling. You're not gonna cry on your birthday. <laughs> Jeremy, bear me. I wrote Jeremy, bear me on the thing. Oh, for yes. Look at, look at my, look at it. It's giving Beth Harmon mental breakdown. God, I'm gonna, I don't even know how I'm gonna feel when it finally comes out. Ugh, that okay. Because <laughs> I love this musical. It was literally my element. I predicted that we were gonna do this musical back when I was still a sophomore. I had a dream that I was Margot. <sighs> wow, I really did that. That really happened. I can't get out of it. Wow. So it's after school. I can do the audition. I know, it's a shocker. It's the first time I've ever, like, skipped a Lake Park audition because I was too nervous. I didn't feel ready and in the slightest. I barely practiced the dance. I haven't practiced the monologue. I've only gone through the song one time with my voice teacher. It's just... It's a lot. I don't know. I'm not sure to convince of playing the monologue about me in any way because I was having a major depressive episode where I couldn't shut out of it. We'll see. Um, it's one day after, well, I mean, it took 12 hours since the cast list came out. I'm very happy with the casting choices, like, good job, guys. I'm so proud of you. Like, I don't know. I was gonna try to convince Upland today that I should be my aunt song, but I'm kinda content with not being in it now. Oh, very cool. All of you. There's gonna be an all call day for, uh, for one. It's gonna be good. It's like two weeks before show.
This is one of the most long standing depressive episodes I've ever had. I felt like shit when I woke up this morning. Season two of Euphoria and like the ending. Oh my god! How many of you guys know how much of a fan of Euphoria I am? Let me show you. This is the screenplay set that I bought like a couple months, like a couple weeks ago, maybe like a week ago. Oh, not a week ago. A few months ago. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm a pretty big fan of the series, even though I think it's problematic in a lot of ways. Still, I do need to talk about something serious. I am not usually like this. I'm usually not like trying to like grasp the straws for something to talk about. I usually do that as like a last resort when I'm feeling like mentally exhausted and that's what I'm kind of feeling right now. And that makes me sad because it makes me feel like I'm a fully realized person. Like. We're gonna go get booster shots today. It's gonna be fun. And also, um, look at this picture of Alexis without any context. <laughs> 